Hey, well, good morning, ladies and germs. I know it's been a minute since I made one of these, but if you know what life been throwing at me lately, uh, it's a miracle we're all even here. Anyway, moving on to begin better things. As you can tell, I've got another one of these. It's a Metacrate Paw box. That's what they're calling it. I'm not being mean or unsavory. But they're calling a Metacrate box. And unfortunately, they put it in a black, um, one of the plainer packagings. I like the more colorful packagings. I don't know about you, but anyway. So we're going to see because I've been sitting on this for, well, not literally. If I was sitting on this, it would not be existing anymore. It'd be really, really flat. And really, really sticky because there's candy in here, but that's not the point. The point is, I've been holding this for a minute, so let's go ahead and see what we got. As you see, my coffee pot in the background. <laughs> oh, and things are falling out. All right, so that's the sticker we get. I think that means milk. Dulce. say two. Two is something. And this is telling me thank you. And that's where it's from, of course. Now, I don't know what this is. Okay. Yes, you could go and get these specialty snacks at their website if you go. There's nothing on the back. All right, so here's the goodie box, literally the goodie box. So I'm going to try and hold it up like this. We're working with a new computer. I hope the picture is a lot better quality. The other computer, remember I fell and I dropped it and, well, it finally crapped out. I think that was only a matter of time. Terrible timing, though. But, it, ooh. Okay, some of these things I'm going to eat. And, oh, dear God, yes. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Look at all that. Look at all that. Oh my God. Now some of this I'm going to be able to eat and some of it I'm not because you know, the sriracha peanuts that I have right here. All right. Yeah. Japones. Something about pepper. I don't know what that means. But I have a friend that works at well, I can't say where she works at. But anyway, <laughs> uh, she loves those things. So that's going to be hers off the bat. Oh, oh. Oh, look at this. I don't know what they are, but they... Oh, I know what they are. I know what they are. I know what they are. Hang on. Now, I normally don't eat all these candies because, like I said, um, if I was to eat all these candies... I'll be bouncing off the wall from here to next week. But you know what? What's the sense in having a, a taste a little video if I'm not going to taste nothing? Oh, do you see that? Do you see that? You see that, don't you? Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Oh. Oh, that's intense. Oh, I have hand. Oh, we hit. Okay, girls, boys, we are hitting this ground running. Okay, it's citrusy. It's really, really strong citrusy. But you can tell that that pepper, the spiciness is really, really intense. But it's not hot. It's not like, oh my God, my lips are burning. No. I mean, I could tolerate this. I could really tolerate this. It has some more of the yummy stuff on it. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Mm-hmm. Oh, God. Yeah. We're going to have fun with that one. Okay, I'm going to have a little stockpile right there. It's an unsable. And I'm just going to open these and taste them and, oh, hell no, I'm not trying that one. Oh, you're out of your mind. Oh, no, 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 no. 
I am not eating that. It looks scary. Look at it. Look at no. Oh hell no. That's gonna go in the the gifting pile. Now I I I know I wanted a Metsa crate. Okay. And there's a lot of hot foods that people like. And that's oh I got three of these. Ooh, see. <laughs> so I'm putting this over here. Duplicate pile. To give pile. I already tasted pile. Alrighty. Oh, these are good. Oh, it's a giant one. Look at that. Look how big that is. Oh. Now what this is, it's um it's like it's like peanuts, but they're ground. So where they're like on the verge of becoming almost like a peanut butter, but still grainy. These are so good. I've got to have a bite. Oh, yeah, I got to have a bite. Okay, we need to move the camera just a wee bit now. Okay. Because I'm holding this up here, and my hands are naturally coming down to there. All right. This is good stuff right here. Whoever thought about doing this, whoever thought about making this candy, oh yeah, that's good, 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 good. Mmm. Okay. Oh, these are so messy to eat. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see those little pieces of liquid. Yeah, well, you see that sauce in the back? Let's see. Right there. And you open up that, that sauce and you put it on that, the licorice. Or the, whatever, you know, the the rainbow candy. And it is so good. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. Okay. Little snaggle peanut got caught up. Anyway. These are so good, and I wish I could eat it right now. There's a problem. These are so bloody messy. Oh my god, they're so messy. It's like you literally need a little fork to eat them with. But yeah, they messy. Hmm, I don't know what those are. Hold on, is it hot? Uh-uh. Oh no! Oh no, no, no. That is a matchstick. Okay? I love y'all. But, hell no. Uh-uh. I ain't putting that in my mouth. I don't care how pretty it is. That is going to my friend that likes the, the hot crap. I ain't putting that. No, hell no. Hell no. Ooh! Eat these. Oh, 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 yes, I failed. Oh my god, look what they gave me. Look what they gave me. Look what they gave me. Look, it's lime flavored. Oh, I tell you, people, the missing out, they are the missing out. Um, if you never had to drink what a mixed lime and cucumber. Mm. This is so, yeah, a little crunchy snack with a hint of lime. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, not too intense. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is definitely middle of the ground. It's not so intense that your child can't eat it. But it gives you enough kick in the ass to give you a little flavor. Mm-hmm. 
Ayan. Hindi na good. So, now, if you go to metricrate.com, Oh, these are really good. Oh mm, my god. I'll put you right there. I'm going nowhere, so I'll be right back, baby. <laughs> if you go on metricrate.com, you can either get all these, get the box, or buy these by the boxes. So, but the thing is, you gotta buy like a dozen at a time. Okay. Oh, these are good. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh. Mmm. 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 Okay, this. Mmm. Mmm. If you like that flan flavor, now um, that uh, Spanish pudding. Don't you dare bark. No, you can't have none. That's mine. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> you can't have this. I don't know what it'll do to get inside, honey. You were doing good just sleeping there. You know that? What you doing? Oh, my God. You should have saw him. He ran out in the rain this morning. He came back sopping wet. Wiped him off with a towel and think, you don't need a bath anymore, do you? He doesn't care if it's raining. He'll go out there. He'll run. He'll bark. I'm hoping he got it out of his system. Lynn, no. We both know what you're talking about. No. <laughs> Not finding him a girlfriend. Would you leave my wallet alone? <laughs> okay. Let me go back. Put this back in here. All right. There we go. Ooh, these are adorable. Look, the little spoons. Oh, those are adorable. Oh, I wonder if these are the tamarind. Ooh, if you never had the pleasure of eating tamarind. <laughs> what it is, it's a fruit that comes in a pod. Um, think of, um, of a snow pea pod. You know, you have the peas in a pod or a green bean. Um, make them really fat to where they're that big around and around that long. And they're brown. So if you've never seen a tamarind fruit, that's what it looks like. And they're extremely tart. They're a little bit sweet, but they're very, very, very tart. Now, I'm smelling apricots in this. It may not be straight tamarind. And it may have mixed it with another fruit so it's not so intense. And let's find out. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh, that's good. Mm. Oh, that is delicious. Oh, I want that out. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, that is so good. That is so good. Yeah. <laughs> mm. I know, after I eat it, then I show it to you. That did not make no sense. But it's delicious. I cannot tell if they mix it with another fruit or not. But it is delicious. Let me put you back over there. Keep everyone else company. <laughs> All right. Oh, and I got another one. And I got another one. So I'll show you the good one before it's all eaten up. Mmm. <laughs> Oh, oh, you sneaky little thing. Okay. There's a slight peppery kick at the end, at the very, very, very end when you think it's over. And it's like, uh-uh, we're not done playing yet. 
So, yeah, that's that was very delicious. Okay. What else? Let's see. That's another one of those lollipops that tastes absolutely delicious. Chili. Well, something with chili on it. Rocas. Rocas. have no idea. And you know what? It don't look too bad. Okay, it's a hard candy. And that's what it looks like. Mm-hmm. Okay. It, it looks good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Not bad. Now, first off, it doesn't taste bad. It does not taste bad. It's sweet, of course. It's candy. So, of course, it's going to be sweet. There's a slight hint of floral in it. Why would they put floral on these candies? Okay, which one was it? Um, okay. Oh, these are the same thing. But this one's a pineapple one. And this one's a strawberry one. And I have no idea what the hell I just ate. Oh, my God. Really? Look, look, look. Now, if I don't... No, but I know I know what this is. This is delicious. <laughs> I know that stuff is delicious. I don't know what the rest of the stuff means. But I get 10 pieces of them. Okay. Let's find out. Let's find out. I have high hopes for this one. High hopes. <laughs> high in the pie. In the sky, hopes. Okay. It stuck out florally. What? Okay, I don't know what the hell is blinking over here. Oh, it's my coffee pot. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> mm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, dear God, now it's coming out. Uh-huh. Okay. That little candy shell. This little candy shell, I would say, has like a, a slight hint of a florally taste. Spicy. Spicy coated tamarind. I don't notice the spice. If I've eaten so much of this spicy candy that my tongue has gone dead. Or I'm tasting floral. I think my taste buds have died. Oh my god. A moment of silence for my taste bud. But that is delicious though. Okay. Another one of these matches. Hell no. I'm not even gonna try it. Nope, nope. Ain't gonna try it. Alright. We got three lovey pups. Three of them. Um, I don't know what they are. I think it's just multi something. Okay, being that we have two blue and one this. Purpley, magenta color. We're going to do a blue one. See what that tastes like. Put you over there. Keep everyone else company. 
Oh dear, 20 minutes almost. Well, this is a twisty twist. That's, this looks like little speckles of, of taste crystals or something crystal. Now we gonna find out what it is. Mm-hmm. Okay, blueberry. Mm-hmm. Give me the feeling of blueberry bubblegum. A blueberry kind of cotton candy thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, if you ever had a noun later, they figured out to put it on a stick. Which, to me, is annoying because I just rather have the now or later and get the hell off my stick. But anyway. Are you kidding me? This has to be a mistake. Why? No. Seriously? Seriously? They're giving hauls? You know why you have this, right? Yeah, in case you're feeling sick. Uh, oh, I'm all sorry. Oh, I'm not going to try that one. That just sent me into all sorts of sideways. Okay, I've got like four more things i got to try. I'm going to pull them out. I'm going to put everything back in the box as best I can because I know I'm not going to be able to close it ever again. And we're going to talk about that. Oh, hell yeah. We're going to talk about that one. Uh, first off, <laughs> if a, before I start opening my mouth about what I'm going to say, I just need to make a point. I was going to school to be a veterinary technician. I did complete the first few years of prep for med school, whatever. I know a thing or two about certain things, maybe. Um, I know that when I was reading the type of mask that are out there, that the ones that are needed has a lot of, basically, the more letters and numbers behind the mask, the tinier the organism is. And believe me, this thing is super, super tiny. Um, I've only seen that many letters and numbers on a mask. Ooh, years ago. Uh, when we were, anyway, uh, it doesn't matter. The thing is, let me just run this down to you. The common, the common one, you know, the one that you eat every year, I can't say it here because I don't want this video to get flagged for whatever reason because of the hysteria that's going on. However, um, this, uh, the common one has a one to two percent fatality rate what we're looking at is around a 3% fatality rate currently. Uh, predictions between 10,000 and 100,000 people falling, succumbing to this. That's a large amount of number. Don't matter how you dice it up. One's too many. Yeah. So what you do is basically what your mom told you to do. Cover your mouth when you sneeze. Cover your mouth when you cough. Um, wash your hands frequently. Don't touch dirty things and put it in your mouth. And God say, quit rubbing your eyes. Now, what is making this extremely dangerous? And I'm going to stop here in a second or two. It's not what it does. It's not what the organism does to the human body. Because, I mean, let's face it. <laughs> when you succumb, it's bad no matter how you dice it up. Uh, what's bad is the incubation days. Incubation days can be 
14 to 21 days. Now, if you're an average person, how many people do you meet on the way? Do you drive to work? Do you commute to work on a bus? How many people on that bus or in the train with you? How many people are in the office if you work in an office? How many people do you meet uh, at the grocery store and lunch? All that time for the next 14 days, you can affect, the average person can affect one week 300,000 people just by coming in contact with them. And nobody's not gonna know if anything is bad is gonna happen for the next 14 to 21 days. It's the incubation period that's scary because that means this thing is gonna reach far and wide. Okay, so what do you do? Treat it like any other emergency. If you know that someone is sick has a compromised immune system, they need errands run, go to the grocery store for them, uh, go to the laundry mat for them, uh, run their errands for them, uh, help them because not everybody has the internet. You know, those of us that are fluent in the internet, if, it, if it's a point that I can't get out my house, I could go online, order food, and it's delivered from the grocery store. Most stores have that nowadays, but not everybody is fluent in the internet. Um, so those people need to be taken care of. Ask your mother is the best advice. Because remember, how did mom keep, when your mom had one sibling that was, had the mumps, she would somehow manage to keep it away from the other kids. Mothers have this knack. So what did your mom do? She kept the plates separate. She kept your rooms separate. I mean, is there a chance you'll still pass it? Sure. But it does keep things down to a minimum. It's the incubation time. It's this incubation time that's getting us. So, so just use common sense. Look at what your mom did. You do the same. And I pretty sure we're going to get all, you know, I can't say, oh, you'll be fine. I am not God, nor do I pretend to be. But we're going to get through this together. And we're going to be on the other side. It's going to be okay. I, I don't know what else to say, but it's going to be okay because that's all I can say. I'm not, I, I can't, I don't have a crystal ball. So I cannot give anyone any kind of sigh of relief. So... I'm sorry I went on a tander. I saw the halls. I thought colds. And then I was like, seriously? This is supposed to be candies. <laughs> but anyway, you just do the best you can to stay, you know, stay healthy. Eat well. Eat healthy. Exercise. Drink plenty of water. If you keep your immune system good, you're going to be good. And if you have a compromised immune system, limit limit your interaction with other people so you stay healthy. And that's it. That is it. There's no ooh, there's no reason to be panic. We're gonna be okay. Anyway, I was busy opening this. Pilmon Pel Rica. I don't know what that means, but I do know that when you pop this thing off, you get something that looks like that, and then you squeeze it like this, and it comes out. Come on. Oh, oh I, feel, I feel pushed back now. Oh, okay, this is a little bit stiff, but it's still cold. Okay, you can't see that, can you? You see that coming up? Yeah. So you're supposed to push this down. Let me push it down where it's supposed to be. Okay. Oh, that looks good. 
Mm-hmm. 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 Oh. That's pure tamarind paste. And that's not like the other ones. This ain't mixed with nothing. Mm. Mm -mm. Okay. Yeah, it looks like little hairs. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm. Mm. I mean, it's serious, but don't let, don't let your nerves get to you. We're all going to pull through this, I think. And it's going to be okay. But anyway. What is this? I thought I knew what it was. I got two of them. Alright, so put the duplicate back in the box. And we're going to open this one. And I am so binging off the wall. And they get up all the sugar. I'm going to have to drink a ton of water now. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. It's just another one of those dippity dips. Only the candy. You see? It's supposed to be a slice of a piece of cucumber, I think. That looks like cucumber. What is that? That's cucumber, isn't it? I don't know. Maybe it's some kind of melon. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Oh, dear God. <coughs> oh, I stuck that in my mouth real good, didn't I? Mm-hmm. Okay, this is cucumber. Yeah, this is a cucumber. This is hot. That's not bad. You like a glint, and we're gonna go back for more. Okay, look at that, look at that, look at that. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh, that's hot. It's not like spicy hot. It's not like that at all. Mmm. But it's definitely intense. That is so intense. Alright. Now this one is the last one. Last two right here. That's the last two. And I'm trying to figure out if this is hot or not. It is mango. You see that? You see it if it is that could oh yeah, there you go. There you go. <coughs> Duplicate over there. I'm gonna put you over here before you kill me. Oh, that's hot. Now, the thing is that I want to eat this, but if it's how I'm going to eat it, I guess. Okay, come on. Let's break you in here. Oh. Okay, okay can we get you in, in here? Um. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Oh. We're going to have a good time together. Mmm. That was so good. <coughs> Mm. Mm. I'm so sorry I bantered off in the middle of this video. 
I'm glad you're still here with me. That is good. Wow. That's a lot of spice. And then just, oh, you can't see it. You just saw that little speckly thing. No. No, and I, I wipe my hand. It was like a lot. Can you even pick that up if I was? No, you can't see that. Faintly. I can see there's a lot of spice on that. Mm. And that's really, really, really good. <clears throat> oh my god, I'm gonna have to drink so much water now. I just took a little bite of everything, and it's really, really good. Um, a few things I'm gonna have to give away that don't do spicy, you know that. And then again, I did order a Mexican candy crate. What was I expecting? You know, so yeah. Again, I, I like to share off my crates with other people, and that's what I'm going to do. I hope you had a good time. Thank you for watching this far. And if you like the video, tell, let me know. Click like. Um, share. If you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. That's cool. Um, I'm that until we meet again, you know, until the next video. Um, I hope for the best. Prepare for the worst, and... I guarantee you we're all going to land somewhere in the middle. See you next time. Bye. <laughs> oh, that damn coffee pot. Let me go turn it off. There you go.